Yo, what is up guys, it's your boy Ro back with another video and in today's video I'm going to be showing you how to deposit money into your crypto wallet, any type of crypto wallet without having to use an ID, like for example if I'm trying to get Coinbase, you don't know what Coinbase is, it's a cryptocurrency um, software where you could deposit money into your crypto, you could buy, sell, trade, invest but you do need an ID and like documents and stuff like I already have one but I'm doing the sake for you guys right here so um, yeah I'm gonna be showing you like this is for users who are like under the age of 18 or if you're 18 but you don't want to use your ID or something like that then yeah you can carry on watching this video that's so um, yeah if you're below the age of 18 you can't really use an ID or, or like your parents don't let you then this video is for you. So first things first, make sure that you have Exodus downloaded. What Exodus is, it's like a cryptocurrency app, just like Coinbase and other stuff, but you just can't deposit money naturally, like there's no deposit like button because this doesn't actually require an ID. So either you're gonna have to get a tip or send yourself money. And how are you gonna send yourself money if there's no deposit and the only thing I could do is Coinbase? Well, thankfully there is this one um, app called Wire Widgets, and basically you could use your credit card to uh, send money to yourself or to any other address if you're paying something in crypto. We don't have a wallet, right? So basically, what you want to do is go here and search out Wire Widget, and then you're gonna press this right here, and then don't click Wire Widget, but you're gonna click Select Payment Method. I'll put this in the link in the description, or you could just search it up. I'll also put this download in the description too. So you're going to click select payment method right here. So I'm going to press that, and then it's going to send me here. So take off this address right here. I think it's just like a default address or like the address. And then choose what like coin you want, okay? So obviously, I'm going to choose Bitcoin. You could choose Ethereum or any of these other 40 coins that they support they don't support all coins unfortunately but at least they support bitcoin ethereum so if you want ethereum you're going to go to exodus you're going to click ethereum and you're going to click receive and then copy the address and then you're going to you know paste the address right here right the ethereum address i'm not going to do ethereum here i'm going to use bitcoin so what i'm going to do is go to exodus click on bitcoin click receive copy this, go back, and then paste my Bitcoin address right here. And then you can click select payment method and choose credit slash debit card. So wherever you're from, and you could choose which like payment currency you could do, you could do, you know, dollars, euros, pounds, Australian dollar, Canadian dollar, New Zealand dollar, Argentinian, Brazilian, you, you, like you get what's going on, right? You can choose like these currencies right here. So, uh, if your currency is not here, then, you know, tough luck. But, like, if you have any of these currencies, then, yeah. So, as you, I'm going to choose pounds because, first of all, I'm from the UK, and second, pounds is my preferred, you know, currency. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to, you know, just put the amount that I want. So I want, like, five pounds. Okay. Oh, let me just put color so you guys won't get confused, you know. Most people are pretty American. So you could use any amount. And I think 1,000 is the max. Yeah, 1,000 is the max. To be trying to put up more than 1,000, I think you have to just like carry on, like keep paying 1,000. Okay, so yeah, I'm, I'm just going to put 5 right here. And yeah, you can't put below $5. I mean, below $4. Actually, wait. Yeah, you can't. $4. You can put four dollars. I think you can put below three. No, you can't put below three. Six. Oh, they allow that. They allow that. Let's see what's max. So they don't support that. Fifteen. Thirty-five. What's that? Two point five. But like, you just can't. Basically, you can't put below three. Okay. So yeah, I'm gonna I'm put myself five, and then I'm gonna. So that payment method, as you can see, they put credit card right here. Um, if you're doing Apple Pay for some reason, Google, uh, they don't want, I don't get it. The browser does not support Apple Pay. I don't know why, but most people are going to choose credit card, so just click credit card, credit slash debit, and then bam, 
are authorized, and then you can press next. As you can see, the fee is big. They have a um, five dollar fee because you're actually paying through credit card, and you know it's their fee. By the way, it's not like the Bitcoin network fee. This is the network fee. You must always face it. Dollars. I mean, face it. So pence. I mean, cents. Uh, and so the transaction, of course, you're paying with a credit card. So of course it's gonna put more fees because this takes more time. So yeah, so right here, pet transaction. And then you're gonna click next, and then bam. So you can put which phone number you wanna put, like you know. So since I'm from the UK, I'm gonna put the United Kingdom. And then as you can see, United States. Since I'm from the UK, I'm gonna click the United Kingdom. And then bam, you can just enter your first name, last name, card details, um, your address and your region. The postal code, like you know, wh wherever you're from, you're just gonna put your house details, your credit card details, your name, surname, and your email with your phone number. So, contact, billing address, and card info. And then you'll press submit. And then I think your purchase should be available like that. And yeah, that's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and it helped you so much. And if it did, be sure to subscribe. You know, like. My subscribers have went down, man. Like, oh, hold on, let's just check how much subscribers I have real quick. You know, I must not have a lot. Alright, I have 357. Like, bro, <laughs> look, I had 370. I don't know what happened, but it's calm. I'm still grateful that I have 300. At least I have over 350. Um, if you guys could help me and get to 400 subscribers, I'll appreciate that. I want 400 subscribers. I appreciate that. And yeah, it's been your boy, bro. And I'm out. Peace.